What's going on guys? I'm Dan. This is Scented Waters and today I got a review for you. I'm a little late on this one, but still, this is my take on it. This is Parfums Vintage King Intense. But before we go any further, how about you hit that like button, hit the subscribe, and hit that bell. So not too long ago, Parfums Vintage came out with another rendition of uh, Aventus, which is King Intense. And there was a lot of reviews on it, some pros, some cons. Um, some reviewers loved it, some didn't. I mean, there's a lot of mixed feedback on this. So this review is pretty much my take on King Intense. First off, the presentation. If you've bought any of the Parfums Vintage Aventus um, renditions, all the boxes pretty much look the same, except for me, I think, uh, Noir and whatnot, but with Parfums Vintage box, has that Creed look to it, has a pineapple um, background, and with the crest of the pineapple front, uh, it says King Intense, which is an all de parfum. Uh, on the back, it has that same beautiful looking, interesting mural in the back, which I think is pretty cool. When it comes to the fragrance itself, same standard bottle that Parfums Vintage uses, um, whether it be the 50 mil or the 100 mil, this is the 50 mil, has the wooden cap, nice sprayer. When it comes to Parfums Vintage sprayers, I think they're one of the best out there that because it has a nice good mist. It, it kind of reminds me of a lesser version of Dior Sauvage, but it's still a great spray. Nice raised labeling on top, which I think is one of the better labels that they have because they also had that um, flat paper wrinkly um, label before, but if they keep on using these, it's always quality. This is great. Um, at the bottom, it shows King Intense with your milliliters, which is 1.7, 50 mil. When it comes to the fragrance itself, I feel it's a very, it's, it's like a fruity, balanced fragrance to me. I like it a lot. It's different from the other Parfums Vintage Aventus renditions. It just seems a lot different. It has a different take, like it seems a little bit fruitier. It has some woods in there as well. Um, with a slight musk tone to it, to me, to me at least. But I like it a lot. When it comes to Parfums Vintage King Intense, the top notes are pineapple, juniper berry, and apple, with a mid notes of blackcurrant, bergamot, rose, and jasmine, with the base of patchouli, ambergris, musk, vanilla, and birch. You do get a, a fruity vibe to it at the top. A slight musk. I feel it smells very different from Pineapple Vintage Intense. It's not as pineapple-y, I feel. Um, it's not as dark as Noir and Noir, Beyond Noir, or whatever, where those are a little bit smokier, not a little bit smokier, a lot smokier. This one's just seemed like a little bit more balanced and a, and a slight woodsy, like slight woodsy feel to it. When it came to projection of King Intense, for me, it got like about an hour of great projection. It smelled very good. Um, the Siage, I don't think was that great when it, came, when it compares to like Pineapple Vintage Intense and, and some of the other ones, but the, the fragrance itself smells very, very good and very different. Now, when it came to longevity, I don't know if it was just my, uh, like my olfactory fatigue that kicked in, but I don't think it lasts as long as uh, Pineapple Vintage Intense. Uh, for me, this one lasted, I think at max four to five hours. I could be wrong because of my, maybe the olfactory fatigue, but when it came to comparing it to the Pineapple Vintage Intense, X-Batch, to me, I don't feel like this one lasted as long great scent i just wish it lasted a little bit longer for me maybe once again maybe it was just the olfactory fatigue but after the first hour of projection it would it really set close to my skin as a skin scent after the first hour maybe first hour and a half and once i got to the three to four hour mark it was like very hard for me to really pick it up um i even had my girlfriend try to smell it on me she said she smelt it very faintly which for me, it's a shame. Um, I really like the smell of this, especially on the opening. I just wish it performed. When I did test this, it was when I just bought it. Then it was more of a poor performing. I think it lasted a little bit less, where the projection was about an hour, but longevity was about maybe two to three hours. Now, I let it sit in a dark, cool place, kind of steeping it. And I felt that it helped it out a lot, where it did seem like it lasted a little bit longer, but comparing to Pineapple Vintage Intense, X-Batch, and, and uh, Vanilla Intense, which I am gonna be setting out a review for, this one, I feel, is on the lower end of longevity spectrum when it comes to longevity. Giving King Intense a rating off of scent alone, 
I give it a good solid eight. Great fruity fragrance at the be at the beginning with a, a nice woodsy base. I feel with a slight musk. When it came to projection and longevity, I gave it like a five because it really was not on par with the other ones. I feel maybe for other people it worked a little bit longer, but for me it did not work. So overall rating on this one, I give this one a, a good six and a half because I think the projection and sillage really killed this one for me. I definitely will be putting a good wearing to this one because I still like the scent even though it doesn't last as long. Do I suggest you go out and pick this up? If you've never bought a Aventus clone or an Aventus rendition or interpretation, why not? If you don't care about longevity, go ahead, pick this one up. I feel it's still, it's a great scent. For me, I don't see myself buying another bottle because I do live in Florida. Um, whether I'm inside or outside, the heat, I'm always in the heat one way or another. So this does not last long on me. So I don't feel like I would buy another bottle. But while I do have the bottle, I will wear the heck out of it because it's a great scent. So there you go, guys. That's my take on King Intense from Parfums Vintage. Let me know in the comment section what you thought. Do you guys have this fragrance? How does it work for you on longevity, projection, compliment factor? If you like this video, hit the like button. If you didn't like the video, hit the like button. Comment, subscribe, hit that bell. King Intense, great scent, but at the end of the day, still scented water.